Hey guys, it's Ian K for Peep This Out, back again with another one for you, Cheaters Camp style, here in Santa Ana, California, because I hear it's on and popping at Taco Bell. And that happens to be because they're test marketing a brand new product over here called a firecracker burrito. That's right, guys, you heard me correctly, a firecracker burrito in both a nacho cheese version and a spicy version. Let's go in and set ourselves up with one. Peep This Out, let me go for one of those new uh, firecracker burritos, the spicy version, please. Uh, no, that's it. Beautiful, thank you. So it looks like it's a buck twenty-nine just for the burrito by itself, and for an extra twenty cents, you get a little packet of those poppin' spices. Hey, yes. Hey, quick question: the uh, that actually the firecracker burrito, the actual tortilla itself that's kind of red. Is there anything in the tortilla, or is it just the color? No, it's just the color. Just the color of it. Yeah. All right, cool. I haven't tried it myself. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. Awesome. Thanks so much. Let's see ya. All right, so is this one gonna deliver the heat to go with the pop? Let's peep this out. It's on and popping at Taco Bell in Santa Ana, California, guys, with the currently in test firecracker burrito wrapped up in a very cool red tortilla that, as you guys just heard, doesn't deliver any extra heat. This is really more for show. Aside from the chipotle sauce that's on the inside here, the heat is going to come from hopefully these guys cayenne popping crystals. And if you guys take a look at the very back of this here, it looks like it is essentially pop rocks with red pepper. Now let me split this firecracker burrito down the middle so we can get a closer look at the inside as well as a closer look at these cayenne popping crystals themselves. All right, and as expected, outside of the red tortilla, we've got the usual Taco Bell goodies here, guys. The seasoned ground beef, the rice, the nacho cheese sauce, the red tortilla chips, the sour cream, and the main difference between this one and the regular nacho cheese version is going to be the inclusion of chipotle sauce. But the main thing is going to be this added to it. And as you guys can see, these are not chopped bacon bits, guys. These are those cayenne popping candies. They have a nice sweet smell as well as a little bit of a heated smell at the same time. Let me add some of the popping candies to it here just to get it ready for action. But it definitely smells pretty good. It's Taco Bell, guys, with a little bit of sweetness in the air. So there you go. It's the currently in test firecracker burrito here at Taco Bell in Santa Ana, California. Let's peep out this flavor. I gotta admit, guys, the color of this tortilla is really throwing me off in addition to the idea of having candy on the inside of a burrito here right now. Let's see if those cayenne popping crystals make a difference. It's the spicy firecracker burrito here at Taco Bell. Mmm. <laughs> cool. Well, I gotta say, I'm getting a lot of front-loaded heat from the chipotle sauce on the inside of this firecracker burrito, and that's expected because there's more of it. But on the back end, is some of that cayenne pop and candy action going off on there. A little bit of sizzling going on, a little bit of that snap crackle pop as well. It's different, but just a little sweet. Let me keep going real quick. Mmm. I still had some more of that candy on the side. Well, it's definitely all about the goodness that we already know from Taco Bell, guys. All those ingredients are popping out a lot more than anything else on top of the chipotle sauce here for all the heat. But on the back end is a very cool gimmicky effect of some crackling going on, which is really kind of cool. Even if it's just a little bit sweet, I definitely dig it. Let me add just a little bit more of these cayenne crystals. It's about a quarter of a package here, guys. Don't let the size of the package fool you because it is really not that full. But they give you just enough, and I think I just lit it up a little too much right now. Whoa, and take a listen. Can you guys hear that? Once it hits the moisture on everything on the inside of the burrito, that's when the sizzling takes over there. And as expected, the same thing happens when you take Pop Rocks anyway. I think this is gonna be a good bite. Here we go. <laughs> wow. That's crazy. Whoa, lit up. It is lit up right now. Wow, you definitely gotta be careful with the amount of Pop Rocks that you layer this with if you guys try this one because it's a little too sweet with too much on there, as expected, because it's concentrated. But I'm really digging that the cayenne comes up on the back end with the chipotle sauce taking front and center. And personally for me, I think it's a nice way to seal off the initial heat that you get right up front because the snap crackle pop at the very end is a very fun thing as you're chewing it. All right, I'm gonna put a whole bunch on here. Hopefully you guys are gonna be able to hear the pop here. Have a listen. It's 4th of July, just a little late. But cool, very, very cool. Man, this thing is still going off. I'm definitely digging the gimmick of it here, guys, but that's exactly what this is. It's a very cool gimmick because it takes the moisture on the inside of this burrito to activate all that goodness once you pour it on yourself. So very, very cool having something like that in addition to a very nice looking tortilla. I only wish the tortilla itself had a little bit more going for it with the addition of the color, but I dig it. So with that said, what do you guys think? Drop some comments down below as this thing continues to pop away right now. Let me know what you guys think of the firecracker burrito. Is this something that you'd like to see nationally? And if so, do you think they should light up the actual tortilla with spice itself? 
drop a comment down below and definitely let me know. And as for the overall score, I'm gonna have to give the Firecracker Burrito here at Taco Bell in Santa Ana, California a super fun eight and a half out of 10. While the gimmick itself gets a solid 10 because the execution works very well, thankfully because you can add as much of those cayenne popping crystals as you like, they do give you a decent amount on the inside of that package. This is still Taco Bell through and through though. So obviously the flavors are gonna be very reminiscent of what you already know, but the gimmick I gotta tell you guys is what sells it. And that's what jumps it up slightly here. So eight and a half definitely works for me score wise. And for any of you guys in the Santa Ana area, I'd highly recommend you swing on down and give this one a try. It's pretty fun. And those are my thoughts on this one as I close out another episode of Peep This Out, guys. Cheaters camp style. And like I always say, I've got new content every single week here on my channel. So while you stay tuned for that next review coming real soon, in the meantime, stay frosty. And real quick, let me send a huge shout out and thank you to Instagrammer and fan of the channel, Elvaro Gonzalez, for the tip on this all new firecracker burrito testing at Taco Bell in Santa Ana, California. And for any of you guys who are local to the area, make sure you hit the description box down below for the exact address to it. It's worth giving a try if you guys are in the area, and I sure hope they take this one national. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon.